Hey everyone, today I'm going to show you a quick fix on getting your gas stove top working. If you go to turn it on and you notice it's clicking and you can smell gas but it just doesn't want to ignite, there's a quick little fix that my father always showed me growing up and uh, hopefully this will help you. So here we go. Okay, for demonstration purposes I'm going to be doing the bottom right here. So what you're going to do is remove these so you can get access to the actual stove top you're going to be looking at. Okay, on the top of most all gas ranges you have this little disc here. You can just pull this off, off to the side. And if you look down into the hole, you see that little copper part right down in here. That's what's releasing the gas and bringing it up. And then the gas goes in here and gets trapped because this lid is on there. And then the gas seeps out through these little vents. And then on the side here, this white little part is the igniter so once that hits the uh, the gas you know in theory everything ignites the problem is if you have spark and you have gas and you're still not getting you know a flame there's something you should check that uh, should help okay so the way the gas reaches the igniter is through this very tiny little hole I'll put an arrow there but that little hole leaks the gas out and brings it right to the igniter where the igniter gives it spark and then you have flame. But you know, over time, cooking and all that stuff, little food particles can get down in there and uh, you know, clog up that hole and prevent the gas from getting to the igniter. So what I do every time that happens is get my girlfriend's earring, which is about the right diameter, or you can use a needle if you have that. But you're just gonna wanna go on the other side where you have access to the hole take your little needle or your earring shove it through clear that hole and you know nine times out of ten that resolves the issues and gets my stove lit back up so depending on what model of range you have the hole might vary it might be on the bottom or on the side like mine is but take a good look and, and try to find that hole and nine times out of ten like I said that resolves my issue so Hope you found this video informative. If you did, please give it a like and uh, hope to see you in the next video. Thanks.